getting a good civics education? Sensing the answer is no, the Pennsylvania courts produced a series of videos and interactive online activities to enhance the offerings of schools across PA. And you might just recognize some of the voices in those videos. Boys and girls, today we are going to learn how the government works. And these videos are an example of how PA courts are working to improve kids' working knowledge of civics and government. Pennsylvania state courts exist to protect our freedoms by upholding the Pennsylvania Constitution. The courts tend to be fairly mysterious to them. And if you don't understand the courts and if you don't understand your rights, then you really stand to lose uh, those rights and, and access to the courts. This digital toolkit is free to schools and offers different videos for students of different ages. In Pennsylvania, juries in criminal cases are usually made up of 12 members. There are also 3D tours of courtrooms and even games for the younger students, but teaching civics is not child's play and has been woefully lacking, Jones says. I think teachers need tools, and that's what this toolkit does. And Jones hopes, along with civics, there's increased civility, which he says is also sorely lacking. That we're a road rage society uh, today, and I'm really concerned about that. Tools like this help with uh, civility. It's not a lost cause. Maybe I'm an, uh, an optimist about it, but I think we can do better than, uh, than we've been, and I think the overhang of COVID hasn't helped that uh, either. Valerie Pritchett and I were honored to be asked to voice those videos. You can find a link to them, that digital toolkit. It's on our website, abc27.com.